Hello, this is Eric at Prince George Ford, and we're taking a look at the 2023 Ford F-150 Lightning in a Lariat trim and powered by a dual e-motor extended range battery, providing you with around 580 horsepower uh, and obviously extended range, but giving you power to all four wheels, giving you all-wheel drive capabilities, fully electric, and running boards down below, but let's take a look inside. Before I forget, looking into the front, you have the frunk, which opens up for you, providing you with a ton of room inside. Even underneath this cover, you have more. And then to the left, you have four outlets, as well as USB and USB-C, that you can use to power your equipment, tools, workshop, even your house in case of an outage. And this closes again with another simple press of a button. Moving around to the side, behind the badge plate here, conveniently, you have your charging port, easy to access. Looking into the back seat where you have comfortable seating for three with a full leather interior that can be lifted up and out of the way to accommodate any other cargo and reveal your collapsible storage box underneath, which can be locked at the hinge. In the middle you have fold out armrests with two cup holders as well as having two more in the middle with a 12 volt USB and USB-C, 120 volt power outlet and heated rear outboard seats. Looking into the front, you have power windows, power mirrors, and power locks, as well as three memory buttons for your power adjustable driver's seat, steering wheel, pedals, and mirrors. Now sitting in the truck with it running and looking at the steering wheel, on the right hand side you have your controls for your center info screen where you can cycle through your trip and battery information, truck information, towing information, navigation, phone, and audio controls, as well as settings for your screen and some other features around your vehicle including my view, which is a sort of favorite screen for any of those subcategories for ease of access. Then moving on to the left where you have your cruise controls with distance pacing technology, lane keeping system, and your hands-free phone and radio controls along the bottom. Moving on, you do have a blue cruise module giving you some form of autonomous driving. You still have to have your hands on the steering wheel, but the car will drive for you. Then looking at your center infotainment screen, which is radio serious and Bluetooth capable, as well as having Apple CarPlay, Android Auto. You have a sketch pad that you can draw on, as well as being able to download some games to play while you're sitting still, obviously not while driving. You have a navigation screen, so you're hopefully not going to get lost. And shifting into reverse, you have a backup camera with a full 360 view, so you can see all around your truck. In the top left, you have further vehicles settings such as your drive modes which are normal sport off-road and tow haul as well as having one pedal drive so if your foot's not on the accelerator your vehicle is braking and slowing down as well as having a locking rear differential uh, and then you have your camera view again with your forward facing camera and then your access settings your towing information and settings zone lighting per power on board so you control the outlets in the frunk bed and cab of the truck you have your park assist intelligent backup power and valet mode moving down you have your climate controls with dual zone front climate as well as heated and air conditioned front seats below that you have your max defrost for ease of access hazards park assist again traction control shut off uh, before I forget, you do also have a premium B&O sound system, so your audio is going to sound pretty decent. Moving to the left, you have your Pro Trailer Backup Controller and Trailer Brake Controller. And on the right, you have a 12 volt and 120 volt power outlet. Down below, you have this compartment with a USB, USB-C, and wireless charging pad. Then you've got your main shifter here, which can be collapsed out of the way from our open space, and so that you can unfold your interior work surface. So if you want to eat in your truck, work in your truck, you have a nice flat surface to do so from. Then you have two cup holders and your lockable center compartment slash armrest with a removable tray, ton of room inside, including another USB and USB-C. And looking back, you have a power sliding rear window, and last but not least, you have a twin panel moonroof so you can let in the sunshine. But that should cover our look at the interior. So now if you're interested, come visit us at Prince George Ford, pgford.ca, or call 250-563-8111, and have a nice day.